Hey guys, my name's Shu, and welcome back to Let's Play Monster Max. You can see Max walking out in his guitar as I was staying idle for a little bit. Uh, I've just gone up the stairs. I've also went back and got the right setup. You need the bag, as well as the sword for this repair thing. I don't really want to interrupt the music. It's just like the rest of the game, it's got a lot of good music in it, even if the sound effects normally are not so good. But hey. I've got to and move on. Kill the future cows. And do that again. <laughs> and pick up the shoes from the other side. Yeah, that's an annoying sound you hear if you No. Okay. <laughs> Brain fart for a second. Yeah, if you walk into something you can't kill with the sword, then it makes an annoying sound. I guess you could take the sword to here, but I don't know if that would help. No, it wouldn't help at all. There's no reason to. And that's not the correct order. It's that. That. What is it? I can't remember. I thought for sure it was... Okay, that's it. So if we can find out... My notes are wrong. Hmm. Not good. Anyway, I do know this one. For sure. Yay! We need the super jump to get over some spikes. It wasn't really necessary, but... Hey. Still pick it up. And there's our bonus. And we now have 349 credits. And we need 130. Yeah. We don't need as many credits as we're going to pick up. As I said last time, well, at least I hope I said last time, I remember saying last time, uh, there's 9,955 unused credits in the game, which is a lot. <laughs> anyway, reward 70 for this one. Getting higher, and 10 bonus in this four. Flashlight find to be not blind, an icy tunnel to a hole of the Whatever that says. Leo, I'm gonna say. I'm gonna call it Leo. Um, the super jump can be kind of useful in this level because it's got annoying invisible. Um, yeah, conveyor belt. annoying and you want to jump this way and again <laughs> I thought that was a passive move having that last one no face to the side also this is a passive move because this way takes you around in circles you do want to get in here to get a super power speed power up there's also a map in there but you need to come back with uh, item from this side and yeah, I, I hate that room too. You need to come back with this duck. Another bastard move. You have to just know that that's there. The whole area which is clearly using the duck in the other route. Useless. Emergency heart. That kills more hurts you. Like so many things in this game. Um, and the combination here is not that. Oh, I know I did wrong. Yeah, that's the combination. <laughs> you need to taunt the first trap back again. Yeah, get that first time around. Um, this door leads to nothing. But there's the flashlight right there. Nice, quick, easy mission, as long as you don't go the wrong way. Which is very easy, of course. Uh, but, of course, with this guy, you shouldn't do that. Uh, 
have been 39 credits. People of Omso gone to ground. The control box must be found. That's one of my favourite lines in the game. It, it, I don't know why. It, it's just... I, I like the tempo. I like it. Right, jumping over traps, which I found that. I shouldn't do that. <laughs> Let's not start humming along. That's cheap. But I do love the music. And I keep on saying I love the music. I realise that I didn't say anything about the music in the first two parts. Which is a real shame, because the music's awesome. Especially for a Game Boy game. And there's a gold body in there. Which you can clearly see, so I don't know why I needed to tell you. Um, yeah, stand on these holes. And do a dance. No, um... <laughs> Yeah, stand on the poles, not to get killed. And you've got to keep on walking for that to work, or otherwise it will fall off your head. Hey, okay. did you know Max? It's learned some etiquette. Walking straight. Uh, always one of these will be needed to be pushed. And if you walk onto the platform and it pushes you back, you know that you pushed the wrong one. I'm pretty sure this is the wrong one. Just shame. I can't go any further because the platform's going the other way. And three this left. This room. So it's hard to fall off. <laughs> Semi small miniature heart attack there. And then we can kill some crabs for the horrors that they have done to us. It'll be fairly quick and obviously accurate. Or else I'll fall on the floor and you've got to jump over them and that's not nice. That's not nice at all. But they do give you two nice three stars. Which is always helpful. And empty point of room. Kill this guy. There we go. Easiest way to get through this. Now unfortunately, there's a trap in here, but I want to break these. That would make things really quite difficult because, well, there's the door right in its sight. But there's a cheap way of getting through this problem. Of resetting the room. Ah, die! There we go. <laughs> Stop avoiding me, aliens. It's not very nice. I'm just trying to kill you. Is that so hard? Bad? Anyway. You want to make a ladder for this, of course. Well, stairway, it's not a ladder. But we know how to do that. We've gone through other parts of the game which require it. There we go. We need to shoot one small one for the next section. And not that section, this section. Because look, there's a trap under a killy thing. You can't jump over it. Well, I guess we kind of could, but it would be very difficult. And why bother? Because, you know, we don't need to take a jump through. <laughs> There's one right there. Yeah, it doesn't matter which of the items you bring into this room. Ducking and shooting him both are useless. Because you need him to get out of the room. And a fairly reused puzzle. We'll see this a couple of times later, I'm sure. Dropping boxes on monsters' heads! Haha! <laughs> we can't stand on him, but we can stand on a box on top of him. Let's make this jump. I'm sure there's a way of um, getting the spell through, but you need extremely good reflexes and yeah. It, I can't do it. <laughs> My reflexes aren't that great, as you can probably tell if you've been watching this all. Haha! <laughs> I hate this alien. I particularly hate this alien because he normally knocks this to the side of the room. Because you can't push it anymore, because you can't pull things in this game. And that means that 
and you get a really, really difficult jump to make. But he hasn't done it this time. So easy jump. And ignore that. Run! Run for your lives! From the Segway riding monster thing. I'm about to say tarantula. I think I meant to say Dracula, but it's not like Dracula either. Anyway. Yeah, you need to break that block and put that back in there instead, or otherwise it'll be useless and you won't be able to make the stairway to get to the radio control box, was it? I can't remember. Ooh, I'm really near the end. Um, see you next time, and keep on playing. Hurry up. Bye.